Hi guys, this is just a short tutorial for you to see how to uh, convert and save your images in Digital Photo Professional. That is Canon's DPP, the free software that you uh, get with your camera purchase, normally for download nowadays. And uh, people don't realize how powerful this software is. And uh, what we're going to do is, I'm going to quickly show you, this is an edit edited image, a uh, Kwai Elephant Bull from an underground hide. Uh, we go to File. Uh, we go to Convert and Save, which is the uh, <clears throat> the window that will open. We save the photo as Elephant. Where we're going to save it? We're going to save it to Desktop. These are your file types you can use. Uh, I'm just going to stay with a simple JPEG. The output resolution, uh, we need to make 96 DPI. We're going to resize the photo. And we're going to uh, resize the photo to my standard size for social media and Facebook, which is 1920 pixels on the long side. Just click there that the aspect ratio is locked. We can include all the shooting information uh, or remove all shooting information. Uh, I like to go to 5 out of 6 for the quality, simply to keep uh, 5 out of 10, sorry, to keep the file size down for social media that it's not too big and then uh, basically you hit save and it'll open a batch processing window one thing with digital photo professional because it has uh, such uh, complex algorithms for the Canon cameras it takes a little while to process this type of uh, convert and save especially for uh, larger size files this image that you see here was shot with the M50 mirrorless so it's about a 30 megapixel uh, file uh, bringing it down to size there we go 99% uh, there we go uh, now we can have a look at the finished image so here we have the finished exported uh, file. It's a JPEG. Again, I'm viewing it on a MacBook, which is 1920 wide pixel on uh, the longer side. The resolution is great. You can also have a look at the file info on this file, and you'll see that the file size is 650 KV. So reasonably small size um, file. Won't take a lot of space. So um, there. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I'll be doing some more on Digital Photo Professional in the near future. Thank you very much.